Hi everyone, welcome to TPP Learning Academy. In this video, we are going to look at administrative e-workflow. We will cover the creation of it and also how to use it. Unlike a patient-related workflow, an administrative workflow allows you to streamline non-patient related work within System 1. There are different ways of using this effectively, and today I will be using an example which is booking a locum staff member for an organisation. This example includes four steps. First, to send a task to the manager to book a locum in. Secondly, to send a task to a system administrator to create a new staff profile. Thirdly, to send a task to the appointment administrator to create a rotor for the locum. And finally, to send a task to the admin team to make sure that they are aware appointments are now available to book for the locum. To begin, navigate to Setup, Data Entry, eWorkflow Templates. Click Create New eWorkflow Template button. On the Details tab, name it Book a Locum Staff Member. Select a category and priority. Untick the box here to indicate that this is a non-patient related workflow. Now click on the Design tab, click Add Item, select the task template named Book a Locum In, which I have created in advance. For more information about how to create a task template, please watch our task templates training video. Once selected, you can see the task template details on the right hand side, including information such as default recipient and the task body. Click OK to confirm the first item. Click on the newly added item. Click Add Item. Choose the second step, which is Create a Staff Profile. Click OK and confirm the second item. The dialog screen should now show you a link between the first and the second item. Thirdly, click on the second item which is Create New Staff Profile on the eWorkflow Setup dialog and click Add Item again. This time, select Create a Rotor for Locum Task Template. Click OK to confirm. Now you should see a link between the second and the third item. Lastly, repeat the steps again. But this time, select the last task template we need, which is a task to the admin team to make sure they know the appointments rotor is now set up. Click OK to confirm. Now this screen shows a final product. Click OK to confirm the setup of this e-workflow. One is finished. You could easily start the process by navigating to Workflow menu, eWorkflow, Start non-patient eWorkflow. Select an appropriate option and whatever the first step is of the setup will then be triggered. In my task list, I should expect to see a task called Book a Locum In in the manager's inbox. From here, to move on to the next step, simply right click on the task and select Action. To learn more about how to manage tasks, please check out our task training video. Thank you for watching and I hope you find this video useful. Please subscribe to our channel for more videos. For more hints and tips, follow us on Twitter at TPP Training Tips. Thank you.